combination six. So the combination is going to start with a jab. However, what we're going to look at is the entire combination first and then chop it up into smaller pieces. Why I'm bringing up the jab is because we're going to be throwing the jab off the center line here. So usually I throw my jab with my head sort of in position. For this combination, I'm going to be throwing the first jab by coming off the midline to get my head out of the way if my opponent is jabbing as well. So I'm going to start from the top, jab off the center, step just to the left, throwing my cross to come off the side. From there, I'm going to duck underneath and go towards my right. From there again, I throw the jab, cross, hook. From the hook, I'm going to duck under and step left. Again, from the top, jab, cross. From there, I'm going to roll underneath my cross, go right, throw a sweeping hook to the body, come back up, uppercut, hook, cross, reset. The pivots left and right can be as big or as small as you want to make them. All we're emphasizing is making sure we're pivoting off the back foot and holding our ground for this combination. So again, jab off the center, cross off the center, roll, jab, cross, hook, roll, jab, cross. From there, underneath, hook, uppercut, hook, cross, reset. Again, jab off the center, cross off the center, duck and roll, jab, cross, hook, roll, jab, cross. From there, hook, uppercut, hook, cross, reset. That's combination six. It's a big one for the day. It's a lot going on, a lot of pivoting and moving with punches. So take your time, go slow, we're getting lots of practice in, we're gonna chop it up, see how that looks.